edition of <laughs> the morning cup. Oh, you got on me about shutting the volume down on my stuff. Yeah, uh, be quiet. <laughs> I can say what I want. To. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, welcome to another edition of the morning cup. Yes. Good morning. Thank you guys for being here. Thanks for liking, commenting, and sharing on all of these videos. We do appreciate it. Oh, we got some comments over here. Steven says, "Good morning from the black Good morning. Good morning. Good to see you guys." David says. April, April Fools. Yes. Ah! Yes, I, I put uh, it in the title today. Not only, not only is it Murphy Monday, it is also April Fool's Day. We're yes. all going to die. <laughs> no, and not. that is not a joke. <laughs> it's like the stars have aligned or something. I don't even know uh, what's going on. Oh, you mean on. like what you put in the title? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, well, what morning, is the title? Say? Morning Cup of April Fool's Murphy Monday or when the stars align to destroy us all. We're screwed, man. <laughs> no, we're not. We are screwed. It's April Fool's Day and Murphy Monday at the same time. <laughs> it, that's it. We're doomed. <laughs> we are friggin' doomed. Oh, my goodness. Dave says, hail Murphy. Hail yeah, today Murphy. we must definitely hail Murphy. <laughs> <gasps> it's not a yes. joke, Murphy. It's not a joke. We really say hail Murphy. <laughs> Please don't kill us all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what have we done? We're doomed, I, man. I, I, we are totally I, I, doomed. I don't know. What have we done? <laughs> I don't know. We're, we're hosed, man. I'm trying to fix it. I, I see that. Oh, man. Uh, really? I can't take. <laughs> I know. You <laughs> need glasses. I don't need glasses. I can see just plain. Yes. Oh, really? Shh. Oh, ye who says, I can't see. <laughs> That better? Hey, look at that. <laughs> there we go. That's better. Now you can see our background. <laughs> Holy cow, we got more comments. Let me oh check over goodness. here. Uh, let's see. Indigo says, and it's my birthday. Or my Friday. Okay. Happy yeah, birthday. Yeah, he needs birthday. <laughs> Well, happy Friday. Yes, happy Kelly Friday. says, good morning from Scott and I. Hope you have a good weekend. Good morning. Good morning. Good yes. to see you. It was an interesting weekend. No, it was horrifying. <laughs> Horrifying, and it's wrapped up with an April Fool's Murphy Monday. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the weekend wasn't too horrible, minus no. yesterday. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, yesterday was due to all the council stuff last week. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. It's always something, Lois. It is. Always it is. something. And it's almost done. And last night you're like, I can't do this anymore. I'm like, come on, you only got what, like five weeks left? Uh, yeah, well, I'm, <sighs> I'm sure those who have gone through similar situations would agree with me when I when I say the person who decided to measure the level of understanding by putting out, you have to have X amount of words written, what should be shot. <laughs> <laughs> you're killing me, Smalls. You're killing me. Yeah, pretty much. It's all about the volume of what you write. Ah, yeah. it, it's ridiculous. And, and it is. It's ridiculous. And and people wonder why. Why do we have to um, just beat around the bush? Why can't we just say what we're meaning? Like, because they're having you practice to be a politician. Uh, well, not a politician, <laughs> but yeah. I mean, in, throughout school, we're taught you have to elaborate. You have to do this. You can't say in one sentence what it is because there is no way you can describe it. They're trying uh, to yeah, make you use your brain more. That is all. Yes, yeah, but oh, I know. Goodness gracious! Great balls of <laughs> friggin' fire! I tell you I what, mean, it really. is just not. Why well, don't no? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's see, Indigo says, pause, are you actually squinting? No. Yes, he was. No, I was Yes, you were. <laughs> Indigo <laughs> says, are you squinting, Chris? No. Yeah, yes. No. Yes. <laughs> no. Because he's blind. <laughs> I'm not blind. I can see just fine. Uh, oh, uh-huh. Right. It's fine. Uh, Mm -hmm. It's a yeah. little, I still got almost scoopies. almost a minute after you say I can't see. I can't. I don't know. What you're <laughs> I can see just fine. It's so mean. You are so full of it. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, I, I don't know oh. what's going on, man. So yeah, that was that was yesterday, and yeah. then mm -hmm. this weekend was filled with the uh, um, council stuff. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but, and, I did get to do some cool stuff. Yeah, you did. There was the skate park thing. Yes, there was. That was fun. Oh. I got to cover the... Yeah, we're not going there yet. We got to do a lead-in, man. See, that's your problem. That's why you have to learn to that's, elaborate in that, your writing. That's not where I was going oh, okay. with it. So you're just going, bam, jump right in. Mm. Got an hour to fill here. <laughs> no, that's not where I was going with it. What? I was...
was going with the the whole scheduling of things. There were a lot of people that were ticked that uh, the council stuff went on this weekend, and they they had to split their time. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, man, we just saying. Are you saying the government should actually know what the hell they're doing and schedule things appropriately? What? Well, there were there were. Since um, when does that happen? It, it was brought up and and it was um, put out that there were scheduling issues with the council, so that's why it took so long to schedule this. I, I'm not touching it. <laughs> I'm telling you, not touching it. Uh, Renee says, "Good Monday morning, April Fools. Nothing good about Mondays. I know it's horrible. <laughs> Read the title." <laughs> oh, April Fool's Day. No. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, um, I got to cover the uh, the skate park grand opening. Mm -hmm. That was exciting. It was fun. It, man, that place was packed. <laughs> yeah. It was. It was really packed. There were a lot of us that wished we could have been there. Yeah, I'm sure. But we were having fun in our own way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, brainstorming and, and drawing charts and stuff. Yeah, um, the retreat was actually a retreat. It wasn't like the last one. <laughs> yeah, the last one was not a retreat. <laughs> no, it was not. I still don't consider that one a and, retreat. And and mm -hmm. and I I told our city manager, you know, he's now raised the bar for the term retreat. Oh. If, yeah. if it, you know, if it turns out that it's not like this again, I, uh, yeah, huh? <laughs> You're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Uh, let's see. Indigo says, "Oh, confrere, mon frère. It's my Friday, so my day is good. It's good day." Yeah, yeah. 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 We it know is. you live backwards, Indigo. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're like but Merlin. You live backwards. It, it's all about perspective, though. It too. is. It is. It's all relative. It is. And no, not relatives like West Virginia relatives. I don't remember. What? Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, the, the skate park thing was cool. That place was packed. I could not believe it. And um, there was there was some issues, you know, because we decided, or I decided, um, that I was going to broadcast it on YouTube mm -hmm. versus normally we broadcast all of our live stuff over here on Facebook. But we're slowly, you know, making YouTube an actual thing because normally we don't focus on it. Well, this would have happened on Facebook as well, unfortunately. But with the YouTube side of things, it was like, oh, my God. So, it's a skate competition, tons of people, all kinds of skating, fun stuff, and they have music playing in the background. And it's not really playing in the background, it's like in the far, I mean, this stuff is loud, they got really big speakers. It's like you were on the stage of it, a concert. Yeah, it was, because, oh, okay. you know, it's a giant concrete bowl that's echoing all the sound. <laughs> so you got tons of music. Well, what is the one thing in the world that social media hates more than anything else? Music. They despise music. They copyright everything. And so, uh, you know, for those of you guys that are in Behind the Hat Unplugged, you saw my post on it. It's actually worse than that. I got not one, not two, not five, not ten, but sixteen. Sixteen copyright violations on one freaking video. That's a lot. Sixteen <laughs> freaking copyright violations. For filming something that everybody wants to see that's happening in a public venue and it's blah, blah, blah. It's the first of its kind. It's amazing. It's this, it's that. 16 freaking copyright violations from YouTube. And uh, so they're like, well, how, how would you like to fix this? Would you like to delete your video? And I'm like, hell no. People want to see what's going on. So they're like, well, you could either replace the music. <laughs> yeah, <not Yeah>. Because <laughs> then I got to pay for the licensing on other songs. Plus, it would be kind of weird. It would be. I was just going to say, because my, my, my particular music choices would probably be slightly different than what they were playing. And they, it would have worked. Second. Yeah, it would have <laughs> worked. And so, they're like, well, your other option is you can mute the songs out of your video. And I'm like, yeah, sure, why not? Oops. <laughs> <laughs> but it was the only option left that was available was to mute the stuff. So, you could now watch the video copyright music free. The whole damn video is completely quiet. <laughs> they muted the whole thing. You can't even hear my commentary because they just muted it every day. Because every single, like, almost second of the entire video had music in it, and they're like, no, you can't do that. <laughs> so, yeah, that was exciting. <laughs> yeah, well, like, what else happened? I, well, I haven't I haven't oh. gotten to that yet. But thank I, you. I thought you uh, forgot uh, about that. You're talking about the accidents? Uh, no, no, no. Oh, okay. Cause, uh, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm still on the YouTube thing. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, Renee says, uh, true, and for some of us, it's payday. Yes. 
Wish it was freaking paid. Yeah, oh, stop. <laughs> Uh, tell you what, man. When you don't pay your bills, it affects everybody else. That's all I'm saying right there. When you are late on your bills, other people can't pay their bills and other people suffer. But that's a different story. Anyway. You have another comment. Oh, okay. It's about the skate park. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, Dave says, I blame Metallica. Yeah, it, it's, it's... It's not just that. that. Yeah, it, this is... Oh, my God. It's, and... and now that the Europeans have passed their stupid law, oh my God, the, the internet is going to freaking die because these people are absolute 100% retards, period. End of discussion. There is no exception to this. Those people need to be hung. That's all I'm saying. We're in this show is for the terror purposes only, but that is a real opinion right there. <laughs> they need to be Aren't hung. all opinions real? Yes. They need to be hung and then lit on fire so we can all watch them burn. So what happened? With what? What else happened with the YouTube? I don't know what. I'm lost. You were banned in all countries. Oh, yeah. I was. <laughs> I, I forgot about that. <laughs> yes. I, that YouTube video actually got banned in all countries. And and I'm like, what? I'm like, why am I banned in all countries? So I went and looked. And apparently there were two or three songs that the high school, the high school decided to play. The high school that had explicit lyrics that have been banned in all countries around the world by YouTube. <laughs> so that was another thing we had to mute as well, obviously, because it wasn't just copyright, you know, copyrighted. It was also explicit and banned in all countries on the planet. I'm just like, what is, <laughs> what is there? Oh my god, I don't even know what to say to that. It's like, what is wrong with you people? <laughs> I mean, seriously. Not the high school YouTube. <laughs> yeah, it's like, how... <laughs> I just... Oh, what are you oh, doing oh, that oh, stuff? Oh, oh. I, I don't even know, you man. the entire thing and then it put in subtitles later on so people know what you're saying. Are those subtitles? <laughs> <laughs> subtitles? <laughs> Money Python thing. Anyway, uh... Let's see, Dave says, uh, there used to be a way to all parts of your description that allows the ambient music to be heard. Nope, not anymore. And especially now that the EU has decided to pass their new law, which is basically going to tax you for links that you have on your website to other links, and, and for memes, you're not allowed to do those without explicit written permission, and there's so many things. It's amazing. They have done such a great job of destroying the internet. You know, the government is really good at wiping out everything that is actually useful. But usually, there, you know, it takes some time or there's a little, little give here or they don't quite get it. Man, the EU is on point. <laughs> I tell you what, they really know how to screw up the world. <laughs> you guys are absolutely amazing over there. I don't even know what to tell you on that. It's like, wow, I, that's like a special kind of dummy. <laughs> I just, what do you do with it? It's like superhero, or I mean, superhero powered stuff. I mean, this is not like your normal level of government fingering stuff and messing things up and causing a mess. This is like next level stuff, man. <laughs> next level stuff. I don't even, it's a... <laughs> what? I'm just waiting for the rant to be done, that's uh, all. Oh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, man. I just... <laughs> so, yeah, there's no way around. I mean... Uh, I, you could, I could go through, but I'd have to fight each one of the... Because uh, Dave was mentioned in the thing. Now, technically, you can kind of do that, where you can put in there and be like, well, it's fair use, because obviously it is. But in the new modern internet world, fair use... Has, it, it, there is no such thing. There's no such thing anymore. But I could go through... And I could dispute each one of the 16 claims and say it's fair use because it's a public venue, it's a public event, and and it would probably go through. It takes between one day, which never happens, and 30 days, which is usually what the thing is, for them to go through. Now, here's the kicker. That's per. Yeah, that's, that's, per. that's per claim. Now, here's the kicker. If one, any single one of those claims that I put in don't go through and gets denied, YouTube does not review that. They automatically put a strike on your account. They don't review it or anything. If the person doesn't agree that it's fair use, you got a strike. Three strikes, and your YouTube account gets shut off. So not really worth it in the end. Uh, no. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, let's see. Uh, Deli says, I just tuned in. Ambient music. What are you saying? Oh, you're moving on to Brexit. Brexit. No, we're not actually, talking about Brexit yet. Actually, I, I was going to say it, it's close to pretty much all related. <laughs> well, no, not, this is a different thing. This is the EU's uh, Article 13 or whatever. They've decided to take a gigantic saguaro cactus and <laughs> jam it up the bleep of the world. Just <laughs> And everyone's like, oh, oh, it burns, get it out. No, not and yet. <laughs> not yet. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> they will once they try to do something. <laughs> Dave says, if you keep waiting for a rant to be done, Lois, this show will not end today. <laughs> Are you saying I'm on a Touché, roll, Dave? Dave. Hey. <laughs> be nice. <laughs> and yes, it's April Fool's Day, but that is not a joke. It's a freaking nightmare. Oh, you think Murphy's got it in for you bad today. I'll tell you what, man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't know. What so maybe is. we need to make friends with uh, Bezos and and Musk, uh-huh. and convince both of them uh-huh. to start their own. Their own what? Um, um, like uh, YouTube and market it, and Facebook and market it. Right, but then it's still on the internet, which means that the rest of the rules still apply. It doesn't matter. Because that's one of the things that the EU did with their little law is that the people that host the information on the internet are now responsible for it. So if something bad happens, the owners of those companies can actually go to jail and get laws pressed against them and fines and the whole nine yards. Yeah, uh (laughs) uh-huh. Yeah. And so my solution is actually quite simple. Because... (laughs) No, yes. This is... Because of what you have done, Europe, you're cut off. We're going to cut the undersea cables, and we're going to build a wall around your ass. <laughs> and if you try and get in our internet, we're going to blow up your computers. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's all I'm saying, right there. Uh, you can stay well, in your own that, little world. That's actually a lot better than, <clears throat> than I thought when you were going. I was being nice, man. <laughs> I was being nice. By the way, thank you guys for being here, and thank you for liking, commenting, and sharing. I got all of these videos. All right, this was for entertainment purposes only. Although today, not so much entertainment. Just saying. It's <laughs> April Fool's Day. It's supposed to be funny. This is not funny. Ah! It could be entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about, man? Oh, oh my geez. goodness. Yeah. I can't handle it. It's time for you to get a haircut. Yeah, I know. I saw the line in my head. Yeah, this side has gone poof. Is it? I can't see it. Yeah, it's gone poof. I can't see it. I can actually... Hey, stop fiddling my... Ow! (laughs) She pulled my hair. (laughs) Yeah, I can actually pull your hair. That's it. (laughs) Cut it all off again. Yeah, I suppose it is about that time. It is, it is. Uh, Let's see. Dave says, ha ha, like Musk cares. That man will then build a new internet despite the EU. Yeah, he would. Exactly. There you go. We can all jump on. But it's easy. We already have the infrastructure. It'd be easier to cut them off and light them on fire. I'm just saying. (laughs) (laughs) Michael says, good morning. Happy April Fool's Day. Good morning. Good morning. morning. Oh, man. I don't know. (laughs) Yeah, I I want to roll it in. Yeah, yeah, you are. Ooh, Let's take it out. We're in this show's for entertainment purposes only. Yes, entertainment purposes only. <laughs> the Purge is entertaining to me. I like it. Just saying. Oh, why do we have to bring things up like that on this show? What? It's fun. We need to do things like that on controversy. Yeah, we're not doing controversy right now. We got too much other crap on our plate. I'm just saying. Yeah, suck it up. <laughs> <laughs> But anyway, yeah, <laughs> it goes with the whole skateboard thing. Yeah, it does. <coughs> it does. But, uh. yeah, no. <laughs> I just... So he, who here was actually able to get out and uh, and go to the skate park, or who was able to watch it on YouTube? <laughs> I couldn't do either. <laughs> oh, yeah, you were stuck. I was stuck. <laughs> I had to, you know, I, I would have brought it up. Mm-hmm. Um, on, you know, on, on YouTube or uh-huh. Facebook because they were shared there. Um, but I, I figured that would take away from the goal of what we were doing this weekend. So, yeah, I decided against it. <laughs> so how, and, how was your retreat, Lois? It was actually really fun. Okay. There, there were times, there were, there were moments of, uh, frustration. What? Really, really. <laughs> what? You do that and I want to flick you. Ooh. 
That's not nice. You, you ask. I know. Asked. I know. Keep telling. Keep telling. Um, but there were. Um, it, I was. I, I was really shocked. It was actually a retreat. You know. Um, it wasn't death by PowerPoint. <laughs> oh god, that's like the worst oh, thing ever. Oh my Death goodness. by PowerPoint. Oh, Who here's uh, had to deal with that? <laughs> Dave, times, I know you have. <laughs> more times than I can remember. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I, I just know. Um they they actually had a moderator. Uh she was very engaging. She knows what she's doing. And the entire goal of it was um <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah. It was that I, impressive that she actually doesn't remember squat. <laughs> no, I, I have so many business terms running through my head. I had to pick out which yeah, one yeah. it was. Um, strategic planning for the city. Uh, okay. So, um, and uh, there were actionable things that are at, truly getting done. Really? Uh, yeah. I don't believe that. <laughs> Excuse me. So, uh, near, at the end, we were all separated into groups. By by uh, <laughs> subject matter we wanted to work on, and then and you built a team together, and everybody fought to the death. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> not yet. Uh, <laughs> so so the group I was in, mm -hmm. um, uh, most of most of the people were people who work at the city, and and obviously, well, everybody has busy lives. But they keep calendars. None of us had our calendars on us. And so we were the only group that uh, didn't leave with with a date to meet up again. <laughs> Everybody else So did. the group that you were a part of worked on all kinds of stuff and decided not to meet again. No, no. We decided to meet again. It was just we we all needed to go home and figure out when we could. <laughs> I'm not sure what to say to about that. <laughs> but we, and the sad thing is we were the only ones who did that. But I do know we're trying to meet within this month, within April. Okay. All right. So, yeah. I don't even, I just, no. <laughs> uh, my brain hurts just thinking about, oh, we got some more comments. We got here. a lot of comments. Kelly says, uh, stick them in the microwave with your peeps. Yes. <laughs> Speaking of microwaves, one of our wonderful viewers out there brought by a microwave that he has donated to the cause of destruction. I oh mean, what? science. <laughs> what? That's science. Oh, no. Oh, no. Weird science. It, yeah, it is weird when, when you're involved. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. So we got a microwave that's been donated to the cause. There's going to be some stuff going down. Thank you for not using ours. And thank you for donating the microwave. We really appreciate it. <laughs> it's amazing. Yeah, there's stuff going down, man. It's going to be ugly. It, yeah. So if anybody sees a mushroom cloud coming from Homestead Studios, it's okay. It's part of the experiment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. What? <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, Renee says, uh, going back to the music thing, when the instructor's video in the classes, uh, they put a verbal disclaimer of, I don't own the rights to any of this music, and they video. Yeah, you can do that. It doesn't matter. Uh, it it doesn't work because because it's, it's a live a, video. Uh, well, other than that, mm -hmm. they also have the the AIs that mm -hmm. that just yeah the bots will auto flag it, man. Yeah, it, yeah, it just yeah, it, it it's complicated and it's a pain in the butt. I don't want to think about it right now because my head's gonna explode. <laughs> but thank you, Renee. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Unfortunately, yeah, yeah. Uh, There's more to it than just putting that. Yeah, it's not as easy as it sounds. Uh, Gina says, uh, I am late tuning in. I'm in Phoenix. Ew, what are you doing down there? Run away, She Phoenix. explains what she's doing. Oh, uh, my granddaughter competed in Cinderella pageant and won the woman's division. Yay, yeah. congratulations. Woo, that is amazing. Congratulations. Escape while you can. Have fun. Yes. <laughs> that too. <laughs> Renee says, uh, my invite to the retreat didn't make it home until Thursday evening, the night before. <laughs> Oh, the majestic stash forgot to bring it today. Somebody's in trouble. Yeah, you pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, what? <laughs> Dave says, please tell me that your group was not about planning and organizing laws. Communication. <laughs> oh, that's, that's priceless. <laughs> His is bad, but yours is even worse. No. The reality is worse than the funny. <laughs> It's about communication. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm done. That's it. Time for me to leave the building. Mm, 
life. But at least we successfully communicated between all of us that none of us had a clue as to when we could meet again. <laughs> I don't think that's the point. <laughs> I don't think that is the point, Lois. I, mm, definitely not. Mm, mm. <laughs> Have you guys communicated since the ending to schedule your stuff? Actually, I, I I did check. Um, unfortunately, they used the wrong email for me. Oh, my God. Um, <laughs> this is our communications but, experts for the city right here. Just saying. We are not claiming to be experts. Fine. It's the committee that's in charge of it. Which one is scarier to you? Trying to improve it. <laughs> you guys can't um, even do it so, amongst yourselves so, and you want to improve somebody else's? So, I checked What is that? Remove the log from your own eye before you point out the splinter in somebody else's or something? Oh, oh my. Jesus. Ow. That's horrifying. Just saying. Um, so I opened up my Outlook this morning, and yes, communication had been done over the weekend. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, I'm going to have them change it to uh, my other one <laughs> that I actually get notified on my phone for because oh. I don't want Microsoft in my stuff. Oh yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> so I use Microsoft was the pre runner to Facebook, man. Oh, they got their digits all up in there. They do. Wrong with them. <laughs> they do. There's only so much per, so many permissions I'll allow apps. Microsoft No. To, uh, my, it, it, when you read through if you have Outlook <coughs> or anything like that on your phone, my and you look yeah, at the permissions, it looks like Microsoft looked at all of the things that they could possibly do, all the apps and the permissions that they request, and put them all into it. Uh -huh. But no. that's how most of them actually work. And by the time you get to Microsoft, you've already done it for everyone else. So why not them, right? And it's like, oh. hey, you know what? You're already bent over, and you already can't feel anything because it's just flappy loose. So yeah, let's no, go ahead and I, jam some more in. I still have <laughs> issues with apps that say, we want to be able to make phone calls. <laughs> we want to change your contacts. But do you, no. No, see, do you know why it does that, though? It, there's actually a purpose for it. Why would it want to be able to make phone calls? So that when you open up an email and you push on somebody's phone number, now it makes a call for you. That's what that's for. I, it, on the <laughs> surface. No, I know, but that's what it's uh -huh. for. And see, now now there are there were some other things that Microsoft does. I, I, what was it, um, to be able to send texts and, and all of this says on its own. And, no, no, you don't need to be doing that stuff. That's funny. Uh -uh. <laughs> Comments are, Dave says, you realize that, that is the very definition of government work. Stereotypes exist for a reason. This is true. Yes. I do realize it's just amazing that you happen to be on it and it's actually going on. It's you know, it's one thing to stereotype it and see it in action. It's another thing when you're right there. I know. It was you. <laughs> it wasn't just it was me. You. It was not just me. We had twelve Who people. <laughs> oh, twelve people. Oh I am a twelfth. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many things I could do with it. But I'm not it's just horrifying. <laughs> but yeah, Such everybody efficiency. else had had a specific date as to as to when they were meeting again. Okay. And uh, we were the only ones. And it looks like we will be working that out today through via email. Okay. Really, really. <laughs> oh my, that is the I don't believe you, Lois sip. Yep. <laughs> Actually, no, because I didn't do the. It, well, it was the look. You can't really do the with with that. Can't. Oh, really? Challenge accepted. It, yeah, you can. <laughs> yeah. I just did it right there. So so yeah. Um, my 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 team of communication communicators. Um, Does not communicate very well. No, we did. Okay. We did. We, we, we communicated that we didn't know when we could meet again. <laughs> and this is the other thing that government is expert at, is deferring blame and passing it around and saying it's not our fault. Yeah, it's government. We have no one else to put it to. We're the only ones doing communications. <laughs> we actually have a team, another team focused on something else that's dependent upon us. Oh, God. <laughs> Thus, the weakest link in the chain <laughs> destroys not, the process. Your group. Oh. Not necessarily you personally, <laughs> Lois. I was going to say, 
say, wait a minute here. <laughs> so, yes. What? Um, but it was, it, it was a lot of fun. Uh, there was a lot more engagement than I, than I had anticipated. Oh, well, that, I suppose that's something. It is. It, it really is. Um, How many people showed up? I want to say around 50 some odd. Hmm, that's actually not too bad. No. So 50 people, was, what is that? It's like... Like 0.01% of the population. So. <laughs> Something like that. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. But, uh, you know, I mean, people had obligations and would come and go. and so, Well, yeah, it, was it was quite, I mean, you had, it was a two-day thing. Mm -hmm. One day was four hours and the second day was eight hours. I mean, holy monkey. Pretty much. Who's going to focus for that long? Apparently not you guys. Ha, 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 ha. At some point, it, it didn't come to you guys to, like, go get your calendar? It was at the end of the day. Oh. It wasn't at the beginning. All right. It was like, you get this done, and we're saying what we are taking away from it, and then we're done. I mean, it was that. It, yeah. Mm -mm. There was no getting our calendars. <laughs> so. Uh -huh. <laughs> and then let's see. Okay, so you did the retreat. There was the skate park thing with the fun YouTubes. Yay. And uh, let's see what else. Oh, yes. Yesterday was homework day. Yeah, it was. Really? That was exciting. <laughs> oh, there was something else that went on yesterday. Was there? Mm-hmm. Uh, what, what have we had to do with the dogs? Um, oh, all right. We're going to go ahead and jump right on into that topic, shall we? Hold on, let me check the comments over here. Dave says, uh, give her the Jane hat. <laughs> nope, she doesn't deserve the Jane hat. She did it to herself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, so for those of you that have been following along for a while, you guys know, you know, we've got a couple of dogs. And that poor Mr. Bengal had, had some surgery, and then he was sick, and then there was this, and then there was that, and then he had, you know, he had a cone, and... Uh, Blah. Anyway, we, we we started bandaging his, his foot. He's got a little foot. He had a little bit of surgery on his foot, and he had some stitches put in there. And we decided we were going to... Because he got so sick, it was because he was stressed out. <laughs> and so we decided that we were going to bandage it and just keep an eye on him so that he wouldn't mess with it. And then the other day, he decided... And, you know, it's funny how quick he is at this kind of thing. It's bandaged really well. He managed... To get it was the Friday. Bandage. Was it Friday? It was Friday okay. during the morning show. Oh, yeah, during the morning. That is what he did. It. Yeah, so he slipped that thing off and he gnawed on his foot and he screwed up his little surgery bit and set himself back a week or two on healing. So, you know, unfortunately, the cone of shame had to come out. And again. He, yeah, again. So, you know, we're like, okay, we're done being nice. You're going to be coned until, you know, for the duration of, of this, which is. <laughs> It, it's sad, but it's also hilarious. It is. Because when he gets the cone on, he'll just sit at the floor, and then you've got this cone, and he'll just stare at you like... <laughs> and he won't move. <laughs> he just sits there. And then if you go, if you go like, in the other room to go do something or whatever, he'll walk in there and then sit down and then just look at you with those eyes. But... He has been healing much faster because he is no longer gnawing on it or licking it or anything like that. Until this morning. No, it was yesterday. Was it yesterday? It was yesterday. It was, okay, well, Because you fine. came into the office while I was doing homework. <laughs> so, so I'm, 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 in, I'm in the office here, and I go out, and Bengal has decided he's given up staring at people for the day. and He's, he's given up on life. Well, yeah, he's given up on life. It's pathetic. <laughs> He sprawled on the couch with his head propped up on one of the arms, his cone, like this. And his legs are just, he's just like, whatever, I'm done. I walk out, and Tiglet, Tigger, the little fat one, has wiggled her way in between the coffee table and the couch, and she is licking his freaking stitched area. I was like, what the f Get away from that! It's like, oh my, what do you have to cone the other dog? Just to keep one dog safe. Uh, She's over there. Look at it. She's like, get the heck away from it. Like, what are you doing? And she's like, what? All happy and excited. And Bengal's just like, Ugh. I couldn't believe it. So I had to go in, obviously, and tell Lois. I'm like, hey, your other dog is licking. Just, 
I mean, what? You got self destructive behavior, which is understandable because I'm sure it's itchy. You know, yeah. all of that. He is unable to do it anymore, so the other dog decides to help out. <laughs> Partners in crime, man! <laughs> We've got one of it! Oh. oh. <coughs> Excuse me. Hi, sir! Uh, let's see, Jane says, come on in, come on in! Come on in! in. <laughs> Thank you for liking, commenting, and sharing. Uh, Renee says, uh, doggy grump toe face. With floppy much. ears. Yeah, he's got the floppy ears, and he's just like... <laughs> and he just sits there. It's funny. It is, it is. So he says, uh, the radar transmitter to focus the guilt trip. <laughs> it, yeah. Uh, the, the, the cone of shame? Yes, the cone yeah, of shame. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Janine says, uh, teamwork dogs. Yeah, pretty much. I just, <laughs> Everything was going so well, and then just quit. <laughs> Oh, anyway, uh, Gina says, uh, apparently he was asked for help. <laughs> yes, <laughs> help, yes. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. That's all it was to me. I can't, just, uh. <laughs> <laughs> So we have to keep an eye on that now. It's like, oh my God. We're going to have to put him in an isolation chamber. <laughs> uh, tell you what, man. I just can't wait for it to finish healing so I don't have to deal with the BS anymore. I'm, I'm sure he wants it to heal too. I mean, the looks, the size, the depression, the other dog causing the, the problems. Yeah, the destruction. Because when he does walk around, you know, it's funny. Because we know he is perfectly capable of navigating this house without hitting anything with the cone on. We've seen it happen. But when he gets really depressed, he'll take it out on you. By slamming that cone into every single thing he can find intentionally and acting depressed about it. Like, he, he's perfectly, he, he gets up on the couch with the cone on and he can spin around and do his whole thing and then he lays down and he's like, ah. But when he's feeling particularly mopey, he'll go over there and he'll, he'll just jam his cone onto the coffee table and try and lift his head up. And he's like, I'm stuck. I can't do anything. And then he'll just stand there and... It's like, we know you can do this. What are you doing? We know that you know. And he, you, it's, so you can tell he's intentionally doing stuff. Like, talk about a depressed dog. And it, 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 just, it is. He's acting out. He, he is. He's he is. passively, aggressively taking his misery out on us. What? That dog is smarter than he looks. Oh, oh see, God. we figured this out now. So it's like, what do you do? <laughs> what do you do with a passive-aggressive dog? <laughs> you leave him coned. I know, but I'm just... It's, uh, the misery, man. And then he'll he'll do this passive-aggressive, like, mopey domination thing where if you're sitting on the couch, he'll sit next to you with his cone pointed at you and he'll just be like... <laughs> <laughs> and you'll look at him and be like, what do you want? And he's just like... And he'll just sit there and stare at no. you. No. Uh, it's horrifying. Oh, it's funny. I don't even... It's just, that dog, he's got some serious problems, man. Oh, some my serious goodness. problems. Oh. And I don't even want to know what the heck he's doing back there right now. I'm sure there's some kind of destruction going yeah, on. Yeah, he, he's in my office, oh, so... Yeah. It's toast. <laughs> I, it is amazing to me, though. He is perfectly capable of getting around without hitting anything with that cone when he mm -hmm. wants to. And just the, the, the focus that he'll have on doing something stupid to get your attention. Like taking out your legs. Yeah, oh, God. <laughs> he did that to me yesterday. He did? <laughs> yeah, he'll come running straight up to you and go, whack. <laughs> and you're like, ah. <laughs> like, my legs, and my the, legs. Cone, the cone is big enough that uh, I don't know if it's intentional where he aims, mm -hmm. but it'll take out your kneecap. Mm -hmm. Well, he knows what he's doing, man. I'm telling you, that dog is way smarter than he looks. Yeah, he, he just... Uh. So, yes, keep your fingers crossed and your prayers out for the dog so that, you know, everything is fast. over soon. Because I don't think we're going to be able to take it much more. That's all I'm saying. Oh. Jiminy crickets, man. Oh, my goodness. That dog has got problems. <laughs> I will not argue with that. Both no. of them do. Yeah, Tigger's a whole other thing. <laughs> that dog. Oh, oh, oh. That dog. Oh. What is that? What is that song? Oh, oh. Personality, huh? Personality. Shut up! Huh? There's a personality song. There's a personality. Yeah, okay. So I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> Be nice, Lois. You've got comments. Oh, no, no, I'm looking. Uh, Janine says, I can picture him doing that. <laughs> He's a, yes, he is silly. Uh -huh. But it's getting old, damn it. <laughs> and Gina says, uh, out of hand time. 
no, no. And and was it Xanax? Or uh, no, don't need any of that. He's, yeah, he's got enough problems. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can't even imagine what that would do to him. <laughs> I don't want to think about Mm-mm. that. No. He's, his normal personality, without the whole Koning situation, he's Eeyore. Yeah. You know, because nobody loves him and just he's a miserable dog unless you're constantly touching him and and he just nobody loves him and that's you know I mean that's what he does <laughs> <laughs> you know and he's, he's, <laughs> and with the coat on he's gone from Eeyore to like I don't even the what is the next level he's lost it man <laughs> Eeyore to the tenth power yeah. I just, I, yeah. <laughs> Eeyore E10. <laughs> <laughs> they are. <laughs> I don't know what to say to that. It's just oh horrifying. Gina says uh, anti anxiety. Yeah. No. no, he's not anxious anymore. No, I, I, now he's just vengeful. Yeah, yeah pretty much. <laughs> yeah, he's gone He's gone from anxious, thank God, because that was what was made him so sick. Mm-hmm. He's gone from anxious to he yes. hates his existence. Oh. Therefore, he's going to take it out on you. Oh, and then last <laughs> night, we took the dogs out. Oh. He was in the cone all day, for the most part. Uh-huh. And you tried to get the leash on him. Uh-huh. And you took the cone off. Uh-huh. And he couldn't figure out what to do. <laughs> he, he had itches along his neck, his face, his ears. He wanted to lick everything. Which is funny because he can, you know, we, we, we do reach in there and scratch and pet him all the time. Yeah, we do. But apparently it's not as good as that hind leg, man. Because <laughs> as soon as that thing came off, he started scratching and he bent in half and then he flopped over on the carpet and started running around in circles with his face pressed into the ground. Like, oh, oh God, I can feel. I'm alive. And he's just going, zoom, 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 zoom. And then scratch, 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 scratch. <laughs> and then, after all of that, that took that took like a good solid two minutes of just craziness. And I... Blah, blah, blah. He went right for that damn foot. And I was like, oh, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> he went right after that foot. And I'm like, ah! <laughs> so, out we went to the bathroom. Yeah. And then we came back in and the cone but, went back on. But him. the yeah. look on his face, he, I mean, you could tell there was distress of... What what do I do? Like which, I, which part so do I address many, first? Yeah, <laughs> there are so many things, and and yeah, the the face was amazing. Yeah. It's funny how expressive his little his little face uh, can He's be. very ex- facially expressive. <laughs> oh, Tina says okay, uh, selects for depression. <laughs> I don't think pills are gonna solve this. That'll cause more issues. It, yeah, <laughs> well, we, we may do the the whole. Um, what is it? Uh, that that squishy sweater thing? Oh, the thunder blanket. The, yeah. yeah, yeah. I don't know. We, that we may give either. that a try. I don't think that's gonna work. At some point. Yeah, he's he's just. I don't know. I don't know. It was. Oh, speaking of. Okay, so you want to know how depressed he is? <laughs> yesterday. How depressed is he? Yesterday, I got I got a uh, um, a treat out of the bag. Oh, oh. <laughs> and Tigger, I mean, you hear, you know, from from the office, she hears the bag. And you can hear this little skittering skipper snap on the floor of her feet skidding. She comes flying out of the office, bounces off of a wall as she skids across the floor and comes shooting out. She's like... <laughs> and, and so I give her her treat and, and, and that craziness is going on. And, and I call Bengal and he's on the couch and I'm in the kitchen so he's, he's over here. I'm like, come on Bengal, come get a treat. And the cone lifts up. He sees what's going on and he's like, ah, oh, to hell with it. And his cone goes down. He just said, that's it. I'm done. So I actually had to go over there and put the treat in the cone. <laughs> I'm like, here you go. And he's like, and he eats it. He's just like, <laughs> it was so pretty. The cone went up. He saw what was going on and the cone went down. He's like, nope, I'm done. <laughs> Sick of it. Oh my goodness. It was ridiculous. <laughs> Oh. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> oh, boy, here we go. Dave says, uh, I picture him laying on a couch with a with a with Freud, Freud saying uh, next to him, saying things like, let's talk about your mother. Why do you think she puts the corner on you? Would it be better if she wore one as well? That dog needs therapy, but he's a sweet boy. Yes, yes. They both need therapy. <laughs> yeah, Tigger's got other issues, man. <laughs> that dog is just a roly-poly bag of freaking psycho. <laughs> I tell you what, man. <laughs> they do. They, they they both need some. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not like they're not loved or something. I'm just saying. <laughs> Maybe that's the problem. Maybe they get too much love. We have to cut it out. 
No. No? Okay. <laughs> That'll cause more issues. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Can you imagine the faces, the looks that we would get? Oh, oh that that would definitely cause more issues. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I just can't that happen. <laughs> you like how, how I went to uh, German with the fruit? Uh, yes, I did. I knew I knew what you were doing. Yes. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> yeah, I, you know I, I'm kind of concerned now thinking about Bengal in your office with the cone of shame on. It, yeah. Sir? I'm concerned. I I would be too. And Tigger's probably eating some clothing in the bathroom. Mm. That's what she does. We're not going there. No, she doesn't eat the clothes. Bengal eats the clothes. All right, fine. But she's the one that eats all the stuffing out of stuffings and and. There you go. Pillows and that's uh-huh. not one where she might chew on something. Uh, probably. I don't want to think about it. <laughs> Toilet I don't paper want to rolls. Oh no! <laughs> Gina says, "Poor baby," and she's laughing. Yeah, it was pathetic. Uh, yeah. I wish you could have seen it. Oh. I should have videoed that. Now, every time I mention that, you say, "No, I don't want to. I don't want to." It was too and... late. It had already happened. I'd have to stage it. It's not as authentic when you have uh, to. So do that. I've I've cut down on my letting you know that. Why are you doing over there? You gonna sneeze. sneeze? Oh, pray many. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. All right, there we go. Oh, I hope. <laughs> Don't you dare! <laughs> that was a very nice. Uh, really, really. Oh my. <laughs> oh goodness, no. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, that's uh, what's going on. Let's see. This week we've got all kinds of craziness going on as well. Right? Do we? Yeah, I think so. You've got more school crap. Yeah, I, I, I will for the next forever. Yeah, we got to go <laughs> go find the people that won't pay their bills so we can pay our bills. Mm-hmm. I have a meeting tonight. There's a meeting tonight? Where's the weather meeting? Ah, what? I have a meeting tonight. It, it's the Parks and Rec Board. Oh, okay. Park, so, Parks and Rec Board meeting tonight. Oh, that's yes. exciting. Yes. Yes. Um, Are you going to give us a report on what's going on, Lois? Tomorrow. <laughs> Duh. No, I figured you'd figure it out now and just tell everybody. <laughs> if you can figure it out now, why would you go to a meeting? <laughs> anyway, what um, else do we have this week? Hopefully, I think that's it. Yeah, I think there's more. I, I think there's more, too, but hopefully that's it. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, all right, you are absolutely no help today whatsoever. No, I'm not. I am not. <laughs> uh, let's see. Janine says, uh, Gina, congrats to Bella. Yes. Yes, congratulations. congratulations. That's amazing, guys. And uh, thank you. We were all excited. I bet. I saw some of the posts that you've been putting up, Gina, and I had no idea. I didn't realize that you guys were down there and that she had won. And... Thank you. That's, That's amazing. amazing. Uh, let's see. Deli says, uh, guilt is good, poor dog. Can we have pictures, please? <laughs> actually, there are plenty of pictures, but they're in behind the hat. Unplugged. That's actually where all of those go. <laughs> yeah. So if you're interested in <laughs> helping to support the network and seeing all kinds of behind the scenes stuff, you can join Behind the Hat Unplugged. For ten dollars a month, you can see the misery unfold <laughs> in real time. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I haven't put one of them recently. Uh, no. But we'll have to do one of them. The, the doing first one. Of them sitting there like Yeah, the first one. Uh, um, I I took one. Oh, did you take one? Okay, mm-hmm. I didn't realize. But it, it was it was before we knew he had anxiety. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Well, the anxiety is gone now. It's just straight depression. <laughs> I know. And vengeful depression. That's the worst kind. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, he knows exactly what he's doing. It's pathetic. He does. He does. He's like, I'm gonna be pissed for this. He's right he's now. a smart doggy. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah, any dog that can passively aggressively take out his feelings on you, that is pretty bad. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. That's a talent. It is. It's not a good talent, but it is a talent. <laughs> Oh my. Oh, uh, see, Gina says, dang, Facebook won't let me like your live broadcast. <sighs> yeah, you know what? I've been having that recently too. Facebook is putting out the like jail. But for those of you that are here and haven't hit that uh, like button or comment or shared, please do. We do appreciate yes. it. Yes. Every single one of those helps. Yes, they do. Gina says, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Marie says, hi, I have a nice week, everyone. Awesome. Hello, Marie. Have a nice week to you as well. It is April Fool's. It is Murphy Monday. We're all going to die. Yes. I don't even know what to do with At that. least school will be done. <laughs> so you're saying this death one, is better. Yeah, at this point, yes. Uh, <laughs> you only got like five weeks left and you're done. You have five weeks. Okay, okay. I will show. After oh, the boy. show. After the show, oh I will show you the homework list for the next I don't weeks. want to see the homework list because then I will be acting like the dog. I will be passing the <laughs> rest to take it out on you. 
You already do it to me. I'm just saying. No, I don't. It's not passive. <laughs> yeah, no, she just mean. Good point. Good point there, Lois. Good point. There's nothing passive about it. <laughs> say it's passive aggressive last night i even told you i think after all of this is done i will hate you for another year for making me do this yes <laughs> you will. it's all right i'll get over it it's worth it <laughs> that's exactly what it. you said last night <laughs> oh there is one thing i want to talk about that happened over the weekend it actually happened yesterday that uh brought horror to my life for those of you that don't know i like cheese <gasps> mm. I am a massive cheese freak. And I'm not just talking in my movies, okay? I'm talking the actual cheese. The this, milk product. I was going to say the stuff for milk. <laughs> I love my cheese, man. And uh, so, came up with a brilliant idea yesterday that uh, I was going to make some grilled cheese for lunch. And I had this thing set, man. I had the buns. They were soaked in real butter to get ready to go into the pan. There was a slice of gouda. Then there was some sharp cheddar. Then there was some provolone. And then I had this other cheese that was left. It was just shredded cheese. But it's been in there, in the fridge, for just a little bit. But it looked okay. And so that went on there as well. And uh, as I am wont to do, I, I decided to... And, you know, and, and, and I put the thing together, and then I put them in the pan so they could start to uh, have their goodness uh, melted in the pan. And uh, as I want to do, I stick my fingers in the bag and throw some of the shredded cheese in my mouth and immediately go, ah! <laughs> So apparently, mildew doesn't have a color, but it is definitely has an odor and a flavor. It was horrifying. <laughs> horrifying. I got mildew cheese in my mouth. <laughs> and I had already swallowed. <laughs> so I was like, <laughs> And, and she heard this in, in the office. I'm in the kitchen. I'm like, Glah. Glah. <laughs> she goes, she's like, what's wrong? I'm like, ah, this is mildew cheese. <laughs> I'm dying. And so obviously, you know, you got to throw it all out because it's shredded. It's in everything. It's already begun to melt. Grilled cheeses is toast. And not in the punny way. <laughs> it's not, the pun not intended. <laughs> Just saying. <coughs> So it was horrifying, and and so I had to go to the store and get new stuff to make new grilled cheese sandwiches, and I decided to make an adult grilled cheese sandwich. Yes, they were very tasty. Yes, it was good because then we, we had there there was there was the gouda, there was the sharp cheddar, there was the provolone, there was even a little parmesan in there. There was tomatoes, there was guac or not guacamole, uh, <laughs> avocados, and then there was the thing bacon. Guacamole is made. Yeah. <laughs> <Shh>. <laughs> And so I put it all together and made those, and then with a nice potato bread, it was... Mm, it was very, very good. It was very good. It was a nice perky tomatoes. Very good. Yes. Did you enjoy them? I did. Okay. I did. You can do them up again today. Oh. Because <laughs> you're talking about what the end result was yes. after your horrifying experience, and it's making me hungry. Yeah, I'm already <laughs> hungry, too. My tummy is going... <laughs> but yeah, I I, I, the, yesterday just... Whew, yeah, you I had, you weren't there. You I had have never that. heard these sounds come from this person like, before. <laughs> it's, like, it's like the cheese betrayed me, man. <laughs> I felt violated. <laughs> yeah, usually you can see when when a cheese has has gotten. Older. Yeah, there's a color, you know. I mean, yeah. there's mold and stuff. Not this one. Mm. No, it snuck up and just. Bam, it was right invisible. There. It was. But you said there was a smell. Couldn't you smell it beforehand? Right, but I didn't stick my face in the bag. <laughs> Apparently, I should have stuck my face in the bag first. <laughs> just saying. Yeah, you don't do that with cheese. You personally don't do that no, I with just eat cheese. It. Yeah. Which, you know, it's a good thing that I did what I normally do and tasted it because otherwise you would have had to eat it melted in your sandwich. Both of us would have. Yeah, we would have taken a big old mildewy bite and I'm like, <laughs> Like, what is that? <laughs> Oh my! And then we'd oh all my. be like, ah. <sighs> that leads terrible. me to a story I I picked up. I don't think we have time. No, for no, it. we don't have time for stuff. <laughs> we, we can do it tomorrow, though. It's just okay. for tomorrow. Okay. Let me check the comments over here. 
Uh, let's see, Renee said, ah, yeah, pretty much, mm-hmm. man. It was gross. But not as bad as the one time I was in a restaurant and got mildewed, moldy, refried beans. But anyway, that was freaking horrifying. Uh, Renee says, uh, been there, ruins the entire meal. Yep, uh-huh. and uh, it was nasty. And uh, Gina says, yum, love adult grilled cheese sandwiches. Yes. Yeah, they were really yes. good. And uh, Janine says, bipolar bingo. <laughs> He is. He, is. he is. Oh my goodness, he is. Yeah, totally. Totally, just, totally. He, yeah, yeah. Mm. He, he, uh, that dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Bipolar and, and what do you, um, codependent. Oh, criminy, is he codependent? <laughs> if he's not buried up her butt, and he, there's something wrong. <laughs> and then he's got, you know, when you're sitting on the couch, he's literally got to be jammed up under her butt. Or he's not happy. Pretty much, yeah. yeah it's pathetic. And, and, and I, I was just thinking about this. He's codependently <laughs> bipolar. Codependent. Man, that is a lot of freaking issues for one dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, guys. Uh-huh. That is all we have time for today. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for liking, commenting, and sharing on all of these videos. We really yes. do appreciate it. Have an amazing April Fool's Murphy Monday and don't die. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Be kind with the April Fools. Yeah, don't don't do anything cruel. It, yeah, you know, I don't really do things, April Fools. So. Neither do I. That was yeah. uh, for me. It was a kid thing. Yeah, um, I never even did it then. I would forget what day it was. <laughs> oh my! Well, it, you know, but but don't be don't be intentionally cruel. It, yeah. yeah. Be nice. Have fun with it, but don't don't. Yeah. There, there's mm-hmm. limits, man. Be nice. There. Are. All right, anyway, anyway. Uh, moving on to more, more. Oh, we got some more comments here. Um, let's see. Janine says, does he have PTSD too? Yes. Yes, he does. <laughs> and Michael says, happy April Fool's Day. Well, happy April Fool's Day. We will actually go into the PTSD on the doggies tomorrow if you want. All right, we can do that. And Michael says, uh, see you on the next one. All right, guys. Definitely. See you on the next one. Have an amazing day. Yes. Rupert! Woo-hoo! Bye! Bye! <laughs>